2017 to 2018. Um, I am living in Gurgaon, India for this school year. Right now it is March 21st, I think, 2018, so I'm almost at the end of my exchange, uh, which I have mixed feelings about as I think every exchange student does. But working here at Karma Animal Foundation has been key to giving back uh, for my exchange and also for learning new things about my country and the culture that is here. Uh, it might not seem at first that working with these dogs really helps because there are millions of street dogs in India. But even though you can't help every street dog, for every street dog that you help, you are turning their life around. You're giving them a new chance. And while doing this, I have learned a lot of things, not only about these dogs who uh, can be somewhat crazy. I don't know if you can see I'm petting a dog right now. Um, but it also teaches you a lot about yourself and about the people around you. Now I'm just going to go through the lessons I've learned working here at Karma Animal Foundation and what I've been taught by these three dogs. <laughs> Bless you. So one of the major things is compassion. I always have thought of myself as a compassionate person. I have three siblings in the U.S. and it, you have to be compassionate in order to form relationships with other people. But these dogs have undying love for anyone and everyone that they meet. You don't have to do anything except love on them and they will love you in the same way. And that I think has taught me a lot. It, it shows a lot not only because this doesn't just apply to dogs. If I'm nice to someone else in India, even if I don't share the language or I come from a completely different background, I can bond with them in an instant. Every single dog here at Karma Animal Foundation lives life to the fullest, whether it be a small puppy or an elderly dog. The dogs are always happy with what they get and they enjoy everything that's placed right in front of them. Likewise, to make the most of my exchange, I try to enjoy what's right in front of me. I have found that the most memorable moments are the times that I'm spending talking with host family or making friends at school. To me, trying new things doesn't have to be a big thing. It can be tasting a new dish or trying a new word in Hindi. on a common expression, which is to never judge a book by its cover. This doesn't just apply to the dogs that come in looking like a mangy, dirty mess, but also to many situations that I've experienced in India. Due to differing cultures, sometimes I'm in a situation which seems very foreign to me. Taking a moment to look at the reasoning behind the action that someone else takes is what really helped me to accept the culture and to understand the culture. In this way, I was looking below the iceberg rather than above the surface. Using this technique has helped me make the most of my exchange. Saying yes to Yes Abroad was one of the best decisions I've ever made. It opened up a world of opportunities for me, and the memories I've made along the way are ones I hope to keep for the rest of my life. <laughs>